in Cass Lake by about 15 minutes from now. We're seeing them moving towards Walker as we speak. A system to the south is moving towards Walker as we speak. Shit's so getting crazy. Going that way. Uh, north of Bemidji, those storms should be moving with a 10 strike and uh, the area around Turtle River as we speak at this point. I'm in the mall park and I don't know where to go. Planes gonna get fucked up. Well, we just told you about uh, Wirt and uh, right Mespa North of Bow Street. Island to the northeast. And uh, I think the wind. He said, I'm out of here. Kmart getting like on the news, getting taken out. Oh, getting taken out. A bunch of people die when the Kmart ceiling collapsed. JC Penny, did they ever get taken out? A good or bad thing for us. So oh. The severe thunderstorms go throughout uh, the central part of our listening area, uh, from all the way down to Dorset, Wilton. It's dark as hell over here. Better get inside, Nige. In the Nebus or Walker area, you're going to want to be uh, washing the skies. Oh! Right now because, again, this is very severe weather. We're oh, that's right. We also have that severe weather system currently that looks like the most severe one as we speak. Actually, uh, to the northeast of Amici, actually, uh, actually north of Black Sox at this point, and uh, that would be uh, moved uh, beyond Washkish and Keller area. Washkish! That's a severe thunderstorm there. I continue updating on the weather and the radar here. And we're still uh, roughly around 710, 715 for this too. I'm going right, I'm going to do like a white person and just go right into the storm. To the north. What the hell is going on over here? Not too far away from yeah. radio towers. Yeah, we can hear some boom. <laughs> radio towers are not always the best thing to be around either at this point. But we're here for you to cover it. Uh, uh, thankfully, I mean, something like this can be easy turned into a... Well, I don't want to say the word, but right now it's just a severe thunderstorm warning and uh, for our area. Winds are the big deal. 60. 
60 mile an hour winds now. National Weather Service again reminding us that uh, they're now oh, having a yeah. small thunderstorm watch again for northern Itasca, southwestern Kuchichings, and that's going to run till 715. And again, that's talking about the system that we're talking about. And now I'm moving over towards, uh, again, uh, Kuchiking counties and northern Itasca county. And uh, that storm that we're talking about again will be near, near a, a Marcel around 705, a Talmud around 7 o'clock. Kimmel around 7.10 and Big Fork around 7.15. Again, uh, that's the storm. It's not a real big storm as far as the center, but it, uh, it certainly has some very high winds and very high hail in that one. And again, the National Weather Service is giving us a quick update on that watch coming in for that. That is what they're hearing the sirens for? Thanks. Sheriff Hodaff with the text message. Uh, oh, 70 nice. mile per hour winds and quarter size hail. So directly from the sheriff right to your cell phone, Mark. I like that. That's pretty good <laughs> connections that way. <laughs> What did they do? Somebody honked at me way after I took off. The call's right. Trying to talk to as many people, so we're still talking. I get to do it then. At the same time, normally we'd have to hang up. We do have weather eye. As they are our tracking the system with their team of people. I don't need a cameraman right now. Yes, we are looking at that very strong group of thunderstorms just inching into the immediate listening area here in Bemidji. The strongest storm centered from just west of Bemidji here, basically near the Area man, this is gonna pop out a tornado, man. Down to the south towards US Highway 71. That, uh, that sort of area in there is where the strongest winds are gonna be. We are looking at winds uh, at least near 70 miles per hour, maybe even a few stronger wind gusts, maybe near closer to 75 miles per hour. So uh, those are gonna be moving into the Bemidji area here, especially uh, along the south side of the city, uh, along that uh, Highway 71 and Highway 2 corridor. So if you are in that area, definitely prepare for those strong wind gusts. Person, it don't necessarily have to be a man. Here in the 